Hello everyone, this is me, Ibrahim Abdel Salam. In this video, I will talk about Logo Web Server. Logo Web Server is a good tool. We can use it to view our logo on board screen or logo TED. Uh, TED. Also, you can have, you can see the variables and you have its password to access Logo Web Server. Uh, the Logo Web Server software it optimize it uh, can uh, optimize its resolution. For, for your web browser or smartphone and tablet so let's see how it works first if you use logo on port screen you need to activate uh, this button so the, what appear in logo on port screen will appear in logo web server uh, from access control you, you have to allow web server access to so see how it works First, we go to our previous example. This is screen. I will allow web server. And for that screen, I will allow web server. And I will allow web server here also. From tools, transfer, access control. And just refresh. I have to memorize my logo IP address. Okay. Okay, if you can see logo access control, I will disable it and then I will give a password. Very easy password. Now allow access control. Yes. Okay. Uh, we need to download. This appears to our logo. Press, press on the button. Okay. Yeah. Now open any web browser you have, Google Chrome or whatever. Write your logo ID address 192.168.222. Press enter. Just simply write the password you have and login. As you can see, you have your logo screen uh, to activate a, and also you can control your logo from the screen. So, for example, press escape. Right, I turn on various modes of the screen. Turn off the cover. Turn on. Turn off. Turn on. Turn off. As you can see, I can write our previous exam exercise. Now screen turn it to white and write how many minutes. Uh, seconds to be able to turn on mode of two again. So as you can see, I can access my logo from any web browser, from your smartphone, from anything. Okay. Can see here green turn to red. Okay. Also, if you you can monitor all the variables. Let's say we will activate the first input and motor one and motor two, and go to local variable. Q1 and Q2 is true. So let's add a new variable Q3. It's false. Uh, we can. Modify it. I will. You can turn it on or turn it off if it's not uh, in your program. What I mean, if I can't modify Q2, if I write 0, the logo will ignore my request. As you can see here, Motor 2 is on sense, it's controlled by your software, by logo software, but Q3 I didn't use in my program so I can modify it to high or to low as I like since it's not blocked with the other logo also you can see many variables that like the memory the analog variables everything you can see here in logo screen uh, also one more important thing you have to know if you want to access your logo through your mobile phone or your tablet it's okay, but your tab and mobile phone must be on the same network 
with your logo. That is the main trick. Not in different network nodes. They must have, be in the same network. Okay. Thank you for watching and goodbye.